Helga with Art Chick Studio and I'm here today with a quick and easy background idea for you. Now what you'll need for this quick background idea is watercolor paper, sharpie marker or markers, a thin and a thick one are great, watercolor crayons, um, any brand is fine and in this one I'm just using the Lyra but really any brand of watercolor crayon is great a uh, watercolor brush, water of course, and, and a circle template. Okay, so where do you start? So, so many times it's like I feel like I want to be creative but I don't know where to start. I'm just kind of lost. So one of my favorite things to do is to just start writing. So I'm just going to start writing today is beautiful outside so you can see that I just filled the page with just random thoughts um, now I'm going to take my sharpie marker it's a little bit thicker and I've got my circle template and I'm just going to draw circles I'm trying to keep them kind of next to each other but, you know, it doesn't have to be perfect. Okay, so now you can see I've filled my page with circles. And now I'm just going to scribble with my watercolor crayons. This is... No, it doesn't need to be perfect. You're just having fun. That's so what I find is just sometimes just going for it, just jumping in can get that creative spark going once you start doing stuff. I'm going to take my other crayon. Again, I'm just scribbling. Once I've got all of my things scribbled, then I'm just going to dip my watercolor brush in water and just start blending that watercolor crayon. Now I could stop there. I'm feeling like I want some more splash of color, so I'm just I'm just flicking my brush against the tip of the watercolor crayon so I can get that nice splatter effect on there. I'm just, you can also pick it up and start letting the drips all go everywhere too, which is really fun playing with those. And there you have it, a quick and easy background. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe for more fun with Art Chicks.